And hello there everyone, welcome back. Bogmod here, and we are playing... Oh, we're playing more Europa Universalis 4 as friends. Playing the politics game. Well, we're doing two games. First, we're exploring the world, as you can see. I've got my, my ship out there, checking things out. Second of all... I am, uh, I am lining up the devouring of Burgundy as my next target. Either that or I go after Flanders. Also a target. But it is not part of the HI. The Brabant. The Papal State and Luca. Hmm. It's probably a little worried about my claims on you. Wait, is Brabant part of the HRE? Monarchy, Gordon Hmm. Is part of the HRD. Okay. Oh, well, well. That always changes the dynamics of things. But in time, we will have to break the might. Hmm. You know, Bohemia is getting decently big. I might befriend them soon. Oh, I should unpause. Let's take a look at our mission. So yeah, now we can build supply depots. That's good. Let's uh, help with that. Priests are preaching heresy. I will crack down on the heresy. So what do we got state firearms. Judgments. Drill gain modifier 40%. Honest purchase of France. More trade power. Handy. Yeah, I think I'll do that. We'll just turn off that notification for now. So, yes, ideally, I would like to colonize some of these, which are 380. I think that's in range. 412. Ah. French West Indies. French Caribbean soon, maybe. Yeah. Nothing like overseas expansion to really kind of get you, give you something to do when you're not punching Europe. Hamburg, Switzerland, and Friesland. Province and Lorraine are your vassals. It's not a lot. So you know what? I'm going to stop with that. Question of rights. Situation's fine. It's fine. Hey Milan, wanna be a buddy? There we are. Yes. Mm -hmm. So here we go. Ah, perfect. I can do it. Now, there are some choice spots. Saltens. Alright, well, let's grab an island. Sending a colonist. Blaise de la Barth. My fanciest of colonists. To uh, Saint Lucia. I'll colonize that. The names are slightly grumpy. <laughs> Which is fine. How are things looking over here? Things are fine. Dead on arrival. Life on board a ship is a lonesome one. Uh, Need to because it explores death. My explorer died. Alright. 
Apparently. Huh. The English are making claims against me. <laughs> Is all I have to say about that. Let's build a spy network against you. Because, my, honestly, my next war... I will want to be able to bring my good friends uh, down in this region to come help me. To help lend me that military oomph to properly break them. I won't be able to take all of it. This is rich land. Far too rich to take in one bite. Two bites, though. That's manageable. And there we are. I have a little colony. Under work. It's going to take a little while to build up. But that's okay. We can work with that. Um, next text gives me more trade range. More cultures. At the shipyard. Yeah. And more states. States is handy. <laughs> Rebels, any time now. You know, move there to make it a little more likely that you guys flip out. Actually, change of plan. Savages savaged my. Oh no. I think they I think they ruined my yes they ruined it. Let's try that again. It's less uprising chance. Ah, I'll wait. The uh my next need two ideas which I can get out of this. Then we get native trading principles, and between the two of those, there should be no chance of an uprising. I'm going to save my points now, or what, three years? Three years. And I get, how many points do I get a month? Or a year? I get 130. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll let things build up. A national epic? Mm, I'll spend on that. I want to have lots of prestige, after all. Mm, no particularly impressive uh, succession issues. It's fine. Shadow Kingdom. The Kingdom of Italy is still formerly part of the Holy Roman Empire. Uh, uh, is still in many ways turned into a Shadow Kingdom within the, with the Italian states acting independently of the Emperor. The failure of successive Emperors to restore Imperial authority in the region has left large areas under the control of states that now reject Imperial authority. But now the Italian states are members of the Empire in name only. Ooh. So here's the question. I just the Ossetans. Cool. Do you count as part of the HRE? No. Death to spies. All right. Perhaps he's doing good. Uh, the Papal States loves me again. Good. Alright. So this is good. Uh, 
Uh, that means Savoy and Milan may have left the... I'm just seeing if I can find this coat of arms. But if he's out of the HRE, which it appears they are, it will make expansion to the region all the better. All right. Ooh. If I invest in these two ideas, I will gain Ugh, I want it. I want the innovation. So, more settlers. Yeah. And less interest. Cool. What's my innovativeness in this? Uh, 7.8. Not bad. Slowly going. Slowly growing. All right. <laughs> so if I declare war on you, oh, it's war. The Portuguese ruler is cruel. Castile has a truce with Burgundy. Ah, I've got a truce too. So yes, let's hold off on that. How many more years? 1495. Ah, so four years. We can w definitely wait then. And get back to drilling, I think. Any other missions I can work on in the meanwhile? Build a treasury. I have two grand. All right. Gain money and production efficiency. So if I conquer Burgundy, I get claims on Lorraine, Savoy, and Piedmont. There we are. Yeah, see? Nice juicy territory. Pure conquest. Okay. Now this will be expensive to get to, because again, it would cost a thousand ducats to qualify for that. Now I have discovered North America. Um, in colonial Canada, colonial region. So yeah. Um, oh, reminds me. Nope. Uh, North Atlantic. So that because the reward is 20 years of more settlers. I can go for bases. More money. Then I get uh, to India, which gives me permanent claims. Mm. Then eventually pushing into the French East Indies. Yeah, we'll take that. Just in case I, I actually make a colony or two. Wouldn't hurt to have. Mm -hmm. Right, military is developing slowly. 21.12%. I mean, it's a decent size. I mean, I don't need to keep all 20 of my warships once I've built them. Hmm. Hmm. The famous.
So here we are. We want to take uh, the certain provinces. There we are. Berahodnus. The noble of the Devo uh, with a strong claim becomes the age of 14. Sire, sire! Great news, the son of our family is next in line to the Breton throne! Well, that's nice. Especially since I plan to annex you after I get my next tech upgrade. Golden area for the Mamluks. Oh, and the Ottomans eat into Hungary. Let's build up more. Peasants war in Lithuania. Oh, ho, ho. oh, the shattering of Lithuania is, is real. What the? Galicia Volhynia. That's a rare sight to see. Odia, Polotsk, Mazavia. Well, Eastern Europe went kaplutz. How is Moscow, Ma Muscovy doing? Oh, the Russians are doing pretty decently for themselves. Castile, Golden Era. Okay. Situation. I will spend money to improve the situation. Money, much preferable than spending my precious mana. What the crapper Ottoman army is doing over here? Wait, the arms are sieging you. What war is this? Okay. Oh no. Uh, I'm gonna put some soldiers there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, what is my range though? So two years, we can go to war. England has almost finished. Oh, what's this? Brabant's opinion? Yeah, I don't care if Brabant is, is grumpy with me, honestly. I don't want to be a vassal. Ever thought about being my vassal, buddy? Nope. A merchant Republic and the economy. Luca would be a vassal. Well, now. Well, well, well. Alright, Luca, your job is to survive. Survive long enough so that I can eat your country. Austria and at war with Venice. No big surprise there. Mm. Right. Um, yeah, I don't care if Liege hates me. Oh, one of my advisors died. Now, you're cheap, so I will keep you employed. So, our queen, a bold, intricate web weaver. Let's, uh, begin the befriending of Luca. Sure, you guys can move through my lands. I don't mind. I don't mind one bit. 
monthly autonomy down, which would get me a reduction in... Ooh, would give me bonus taxes. Uh, that will have to wait, sadly. Oh no! Ottomans! Why, Ottomans? Why? We could have been such good friends. No. Courthouse time! There we go. Ah, the courthouse. The problem with that hereditary local nobility is they tend to value their local interests over those of the rest of the nation. Yeah, that is a shame. Pass the Uniformity Act, you say. Better missionaries? Ah, oh, but it makes my institutions cost more. And I don't want to spend more money at the moment. <laughs> Economy continues to grow. Excellent. Someone hit level 8 seven years ago. Ooh, that reminds me. What triggers colonialism? Where can it spawn? You've got, to be, you've got at least seven years. One of the following must be true. Montpellier. Land is an estate. It's 12. It's from the world. So, if, if I read this right, have a port in the Montpellier. Well, what if I, is that a, is it, oh, that's a dock. Um, All right. Trade France modifier. Uh, at least twelve. Mm, does that impact it? I wonder. Would be nice if I was the one to get it. It would also be nice if I took that away from them. <laughs> Alright, well, my truce is about to finish with the Burgundies. Oh no. It's definitely slowing things down. I'm going to shift my focus a little. Truces have completed. Yes, I could get a new exploration idea. But I can't afford. I can't afford to fall too far behind with the technologies. I want the technological bonuses they bring me. Alright. Enough training. Let's get ready for war. Because Burgundy is a delicious looking province. Let's see. Oh, colonial enthusiasm. Yes, 25% settler increase, 5% settler chance. Possibly the new world. The new world beckons. Yes, it does. 65 a year. Much better. Hopefully we'll, uh, we'll get that going without uh, too many uh, native problems. All right, we're going to take a break here. Next time, we're probably going to punch Burgundy in the face. So uh, stay tuned for that, everyone. Talk to you later.